I think it would be perfect to go fishing at this time. I should hurry up before it gets too dark and cold. This place will be perfect for fishing. The main thing for me is to throw the bait and wait for the fish to bite. Is the fish awake now? Maybe they also have time when they all go to sleep? Does this mean that someone also woke up and went to peck at the bait? I think it will be too long to wait. I'd better catch all the fish with my own hands. Hello everyone, your favorite journalist Alice is with you. Now I'm going to tell you about what we just discovered at the local lake. As you can see for yourself, there are a lot of dead fish here, and we have no idea who or what killed them all. It's possible that poachers appeared in our village. We can't deny that either. The most important thing is that no one heard anyone screaming or shooting. This makes the whole thing even more difficult. These fish were definitely not shot at. I can say this as the person who sees it all with his own eyes but there is not a single trace that this fish was shot at. If you want, I can provide you with a photo of the confirmation later. I want to thank you for watching and being with me. I hope that you are not the people who killed these fish. Take care of yourself and your... <laughs> Good morning, Mikey. Weren't you afraid to sleep at night? I have a feeling that I heard someone screaming at night. Or what was it? In general, I slept very badly, so I don't have much energy for today. Let's harvest the carrots faster before it's too late. Good. To be honest, I'm even a little glad that you didn't get enough sleep. I didn't want to go anywhere today. So let's harvest, cook something very tasty, or order food and watch the new series that we saw on TV. All right. Huh? Hmm? Wait, JJ, do you see that crowd over there? What's going on there? Hi, guys. What happened here? Why are you gathered here? Mikey, I think I think we shouldn't have come here. Oh, no. It's a journalist named Alice. Was she murdered? Which means that it was her screams that I heard. What a horror it is. What's that over there? JJ, it feels like it's just a lake of blood. I think it looks terrible. Why are there so many fish here? Who could have done this? Are the police aware of all this already? JJ, what do you think about this? I don't even know what to think. I don't think anyone could have shot all these fish. It was probably someone else. And what happened to Alice is just a nightmare. I think we need to be even more careful in our village now. We can't know who it was. Therefore, the best thing for us now is to go home and sit there until we are told that we can safely walk around our village. We have weapons, so we will definitely be able to defend ourselves from this killer. So everything is going the way you wanted it to be today. Then let's go home and have a good meal or even watch that series you were talking about. But I didn't understand what it was about and what the essence of the series is. What? What happened to Alice? Are you all right? Why are you lying here? Whoa, what are you? Where did you come from here? Don't follow me. Leave me alone. I don't want to fight you. Is this JJ and Mikey's house? Great, so they can help me. JJ and Mikey, please save me. There's a monster chasing me. JJ, did you hear that too? Like someone was shouting our names? Let's go and see what it was. Did you hear that too? But apparently it seemed to us because there is absolutely no one here. I don't think anyone would come to visit us at such a late hour. JJ, did you hear those sounds too? Let's better check the whole house to make sure that there is no one in our house. At least there's definitely no one in our attic. I don't know why we're doing this. There is only one entrance to our house and there is no way to get into ah! the house anymore. And how do you explain this? I definitely didn't leave this blood trail and the blood leads to our basement. JJ, I think we should check the basement too. Ah! Whoa. I think there's definitely someone here. I don't even know what to say because it all looks very strange. I would say that it is terribly strange. 
Look over there! Do you see this thing? I do not know what it is. It's hardly a stove. Definitely not that. Who could have brought this here? We definitely didn't order this. Huh? <laughs> ah! JJ, let's get out of here. There's some kind of monster here. I can't believe this monster was in our basement. How did it even work out? Mikey, push faster. I can feel the breath of this monster. Phew! It wasn't easy to escape from there. I already thought that we were definitely finished. It's lucky that that monster decided to leave us alone. JJ, I'm not leaving it like this. We go to the police station in the morning and write a statement that some kind of monster has taken over our house. Even if they don't believe us, at least we'll try. All right. Hello, Officer Adam. We want to say that our house was attacked and captured by some kind of monster. Would you be able to sort this out? I understand you. Wait for me here. I'll be back soon. JJ, it seems like they believed us. How good it feels to feel better now. Mm-hmm. JJ and Mikey, I think you should stay in this place for now until we kill this monster. Okay? Guys, follow me. I hope that they will succeed, and soon we will be lying on our beds in peace and quiet. I am already so tired that I just want to lie down on some couch. Listen to me carefully. It turned out to be true, because there is a very dangerous monster in this house. I ask you to stay away from here until something worse happens than just killing a couple of special forces. Now we are waiting for messages from our superiors about what we need to do. In the meantime, I'm telling all of you to hold your positions. And if you see that some kind of monster or something very strange is happening, then immediately shoot it without any doubt. I hope you understand me. This is an order. Sir, yes, sir! Sir, I can show you the recordings from our drone. Look at this. You see, there are already a couple of special forces lying there, which means that the creature inside this house is very strong that even Captain Adam decided to retreat. Mikey, let's go to our house soon. I told them that we should go there and help them all because I heard the news that there are a couple injured. I can't believe that this monster was so strong. Look how many special forces are here. They really want to kill this monster. I hope we can do it. Mm-hmm. Now open the chest and you'll see a bunch of weapons there. It's just incredible how many weapons we can try now. Have you ever seen so many guns in the same chest? For example, I'm not, but now we can try it all out, not only in games. JJ, looking at all this, there are more than a couple of victims here. It seems to me that there will be even more of them here if we go into the basement. Let's quietly try to attack this monster to catch him off guard. Good, but we can just go to the basement and shoot this monster as fast as we can. Let's do exactly that. Look at this. He thinks that there is no one else here and he can kill anyone he wants. But it's not like that, because now that we have weapons, we can fight back against you. JJ, and this monster is not going to give up so easily. Look at this. He wants to fight us. He's attacking. JJ, beware of this monster. The two of us don't know what he's really capable of. I don't think he's capable of anything if he decided to run away from us. So let's just finish him off. Phew, I thought it would be much more difficult. JJ, but this monster has already killed so many special forces. I think that we could also become heroes of this village. Hey, hey. Ha 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 ha, I'm finally out of prison. Now you're all dead. Do you want to know what I'm capable of? Or maybe you want a couple of gifts from me? How do you like that? Do you like it? Right. I like it, of course, because the Great Visor has come here to punish you all. Do you want to know what I went through to get here? I came out of hell to punish you all. Do you understand what awaits you? Of course you understand. Therefore, it would be better for you to run away from here. Save me! Somebody help me! This stupid ghost is running after me. I had a very bad night's sleep. What were those sounds at night? How's Mikey? Does he know anything? We should find out what happened there last night. That's why we need to call Mikey, Mikey. Get out of the house soon. JJ, did you call me? What happened? Did you sleep badly last night too? It seemed to me like someone was screaming at night. That's what I wanted to ask you too. I thought I was the only one who heard them. What do you think it was? I don't even know, but I think that poster over there will explain it to us. Let's go take a closer look at what it says. What is it? Windstorm attack? What kind of monster is this that wants to attack our village? I don't know. Do you think this village has any chance of withstanding this attack? I think not at all either. Ghost attack? 
What kind of posters are these? What is going on in this village anyway? How could this happen while we were sleeping? I can't believe all this is going to happen here. We need to do something about it, don't you think? Yes! That's why we're going to the workshop! I think he knows exactly what to do! Hi, man! What are you selling? Hi, guys! Do you already know who is attacking our village? I have a ghost locator and a wither shotgun. I think this is exactly what we need. But how do we get it? Do you have any money? I have a couple of dead bushes. I give you one if it helps with the purchase. Nah. <laughs> what are we going to do? JJ! Hmm? Look over there! There's some kind of mine! Let's go there and see if there are diamonds there! How lucky we are that there is a mine here! I hope there are a lot of diamonds there! Hmm? It seems this mine is closed! We need to find the key! Any idea where we can find this key? And here is another mine! We have to find this key here in the chest! You just need to find the key to the chest first, which will contain the key to the mine! Ugh! I'm confused! And I found the key! How good it is! Now we take the key from this chest that was opened with the key from this mine, and go to the mine to open with the key. Phew! I thought I was confused. How many diamonds are there? I hope you took a pickaxe? Great! Now let's get all the diamonds in this mine so that we can buy weapons and a locator from that cellar. Hey, hey! Now that we have so many diamonds, let's go to that workshop before it closes. I hope the cellar hasn't gone anywhere. And if it is not there, then we must say that we have a lot of diamonds. I think it's time to say it! We have a bunch of diamonds! Who said diamonds? Is that you? Did you bring the money? It's so good that these are diamonds. Thank you. Here is your locator and your weapon. I hope you can handle all the monsters that attacked our village. I wish you good luck. Sheesh! There are really a lot of weapons here. Thank you, man. Don't worry. We will kill all the monsters that attacked our village. Mikey! Is there a plan for how we will do this? It seems they have to attack very soon. Take this! We need to cover our houses with this so as not to destroy them accidentally. At night, we go out of the window and shoot at everything that moves. And if it doesn't move, then we make it move. What a good friend after all. He gave me things that will protect the integrity of my house. I'm lucky that we were able to find a weapon and a locator. I think we can definitely handle this with all five monsters that will attack us at night. You just have to be ready for this moment. Great! The window offers a great view of the street. It remains only to wait for the night when the locator starts making some sounds. It seems that the locator has started to react to something. But for what? There's a red moon outside. What could it mean? Is there something wrong with the locator? What? No! Everything is fine with the locator. It's Storm Wither. Mikey, do you see this monster? How huge it is. I can't believe we can destroy this. Take the weapon that the pro dealer sold us and shoot him with all the cartridges. Spare no bullets on him. We can't let him destroy anything. It's literally the size of my house. I don't think this defense will work against this monster. He's too big and strong. I think he could just swallow my house if he wanted to. What a horror it is. JJ, are you coping there? I'm doing fine. But something tells me that this monster is not going to die so easily. I think he's up to something. Mikey, watch out for him. He's not coming for you. Hide inside the house. <laughs> Mikey, are you all right? Try to stand a little longer. I'm coming to your rescue now. How can I go to him quickly? If I jump off the roof, I'll lose my legs. I must run to him now. Hang in there, Mikey. I can wait here, but please run here faster. I don't like the way he looks at me. Why are you looking at me, you stupid monster? Get off me already! Mm -hmm. uh, 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 what? What happened to me? Am I a ghost now? How did it happen? I can't believe I'm seeing ghosts now. What are you all doing in my house? Mikey, precisely. How could I forget about him? How is he doing? Hmm? It seems Mikey was able to kill that monster, but I don't see Mikey himself. It's strange. He usually runs to me to tell me that he killed some kind of monster. Hey, you ghosts! Have you seen anything? Is there any Mikey among you? Ugh. Mikey! What happened to you? Why did you become a big windstorm? How could this happen? I think it's time for me to take you on and get you out of this mess, or kill you! Get ready for battle, you monster! You're going to have to lie to me, Mikey, no matter what it takes! JJ, it's me! Don't you see? 
I just got a little smarter and realized one thing. That you're not my friend. You're some kind of dumb little ghost. How can you be my friend? I think not. It would be better for you to die and not for me. Therefore, it's better for you to prepare for death at my hands. More precisely, from my tentacles. You're not Mikey. The real Mikey would never say that even when I hurt him so much. But he doesn't say such things. Especially since the real Mikey hates tentacles. So you better give up on a good one or I'll have to kill you or pull Mikey out of you by brute force. You're definitely not gonna like this. Trust me, you stupid monster. The real Mikey thinks the same thing. He's just too dumb to think about it for long. He just forgets it. That's why I'm helping him get rid of idiots like you. Do you really think you can beat me? You think too highly of yourself. I'll take you so deep down that you'll forget what self-esteem is. You'd better do something instead of talking a lot. You talk too much. It's time for you to shut up. What is it? It seems like you're already losing. I think it's time for you to say bye. I hope we never meet again. <laughs> So the moment has come when I can say that you were just an ordinary wastrel. Now we have to get the jerseys out of you somehow. But how to do it? There must be a way? Hmm? I hope these potions work. Please, Mikey, come back here. I want you to come back. What? Who are you? Hmm? JJ, what happened to you? How did you become a ghost? Are you dead? A lot of things have happened, but huh? yes, I'm a ghost. Hmm? Uh, 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 ah! What are you doing? Let my friend go now. You have no right to take him away. Put it down quickly and give it to me. This is my friend. You can't take him away. I'll kill you, you ghost. It seems these weapons don't work against ghosts. But even so, I'm going to shoot you because I hope that you will feel the heat from this nuclear weapon. You don't like it, do you? Hmm? What are you doing? Let me go quickly, you stupid ghost. If you don't do it yourself, I'll do it with my own hands. I still have the potions. Get it! Huh? Mm-hmm. Am I, am I a ghost? Did it really work? I thought I was just banishing a ghost from this world. No, but it's, it's JJ. Yo, this is a song for my family. Their names are Freya and JJ Jr. They are the best thing in my life. It's just because I'm JJ. Yo. It wasn't bad. I would give you 10 out of 10. Yes, Dad, you're the best. You're kidding me. It was the worst performance of a song I've ever heard in my life. I couldn't believe it was all true. I think A&M needs to make sure that he can never sing again in this life. His voice is so nasty. Yes, Mikey. You're right. We have to destroy it all now so that he can never sing again. What are we going to do then? Shall we destroy his devices? That's exactly what we have to do. You don't want to listen to these stupid songs for a very long time, do you? I'm even ready to destroy his yard so that he no longer thinks about spending money to restore devices for music. Then Mikey Jr. and I will break the piano, drums, and microphone, Mikey. Why are you ruining their garden? I think they're still not spending money to grow vegetables. I don't care. I just wanted to do it all in the end. We need to leave our painting here. Everyone needs to spit on his house and now we can leave. Right. I think we can go home now. Huh? Huh? I've come up with a new rhyme for this song. Let's go write it down before I forget. Can your song get even better? I can't believe it. You're just a genius. Hmm? What happened here? I don't know, but our devices were taken away. I even know who did it. Mikey lives not far away. It's time for us to visit him and arrange something wonderful there that he did to our house. In general, you need to take TNT and put it all inside the house, and then we'll go home and blow it all up from there. It's going to be a lot of fun. Let's do it quietly and quickly. I'm afraid they might wake up if we make noise. Good. I can't believe you had so much here with you. I don't even know what to say, whether you're a psycho or a genius. But it doesn't matter, because revenge is a dish that is served cold, or in our case, very hot. And now let's go home and see what happens to his house when I press this button. I want to hear Mikey's reaction to this. I don't think he's going to like it. here why did my house suddenly explode it couldn't have happened like this could it someone did it intentionally maybe even i know exactly who did it it's too obvious i'm even sure that jj did it stupid jj how dare you do that now i have to do something with you but how will i do it 
I don't have anything to take my revenge on! Huh? The store! What can I buy there? I need to find out right now! Maybe there's something there for revenge? Hmm? What is that poster there? Become a wither storm? Hi, Mikey. Don't ask me how I know you. Just listen carefully. In order to become a windstorm, you just have to pay me 64 bucks. No one else can help you because you want revenge. You can easily do this with my potion. Good. Just wait here. I don't have any money yet. How do I find the money? Maybe I should go to the bank. There's always money there, for sure. I'm going there now. What? $64 for what? For the weapons? What are these strange weapons? I haven't seen them yet. Mikey, you won't believe it, but the money has just been taken away. That's why we don't have a cent right now. There's nothing in the safes upstairs. You can check for yourself. I'm sorry that I can't help you. That's what I think about it. Stupid bank. I won't come here anymore. And where can I find the money? Hmm? The mine? Precisely. How could you forget about the boat? I hope there's a lot of expensive ore there. Hi, guy. Are you likely to trade everything I dig up there? Great. It's good that I brought a pickaxe with me. Whoa! There are so many emeralds here. This is definitely enough for me to buy a potion from that strange... Finally dug up all these emeralds? Hey, kid. Trade me all this for dollars. Now I'm going to that weird vendor for potions that will help me get back at JJ. I hope he hasn't gone anywhere, because I brought a lot of money with me for this seller. I hear you brought a lot of money. It's just great. Then give me all the money you have, and I can throw potions at you that will turn you into a wither storm. Only it seems to me that there is not enough space in the store. It would be better if I throw potions at you on the street. <laughs> I can't believe my eyes. These potions really worked. Hey you, how are you doing? I feel great. Thank you very much. Now you better get out of the village so I don't accidentally kill you. JJ, it's finally raining outside. Let's go see what's in there. All right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Why does this huge cloud look like a mutated Mikey? This is very bad. I think he wanted to take revenge on us, so he decided to become a monster. Hey, Mikey. Why would you do that? Are you a complete idiot? Well... If you don't want to answer me, then talk to the cannon itself. Let's see what happens to you when I shoot you with this. Do you think you're the strongest or what? Not in this village. I'll find a cop to finish you off. Even if not with this weapon, but you shouldn't have done it. JJ, he doesn't even seem to want to hear from you. Come here. I have an idea how to calm him down. JJ Jr. and I will take healing potions and cure his family who is lying at home. But in the meantime, take the money from the chest in the attic and then buy weapons from that store with this money? Try to calm him down this way. Good! Try to do it your way. But it seems to me that I will kill him faster than you will do it. But I will try to knock him out and not kill him. But you'd better hurry up with this case. No problem. You do this for now, and we're running as fast as we can to Mikey's ruined house. Please be careful. Don't forget that he wants to kill you and not just destroy your house. Good, whatever you say. Where's Mikey? I don't believe that you really became a huge dumb cloud in order to kill me. You're so weird, but soon you'll regret what you did. Trust me, I'll buy a couple of cool weapons and stun you. Hello, JJ. If you want to stop that windstorm, then my weapon will help you with that. Mm -hmm. Who are you? Come on, stand where you are. I've come to collect your diamonds. Don't even think about resisting, because I can kill you very easily. Do you understand that? Uh -huh. Great. Give everything you have and everything will be fine. How many diamonds do you have? That's all we have! Thank you very much for this gift. Oh, he just came and took all our diamonds. It's just not fair. I can't believe we were just robbed like some suckers. What are we going to do now? I don't know. I would run after him, but he has a knife and I'm very scared. I think we'll just have to let him go and go home to sleep. <laughs> what stupid monkeys you are if you think you could survive in these stupid houses. You need normal houses, like me. Live in the trees.
Why did you come down to Earth at all? Isn't that funny? You have to live in trees. It's obvious, isn't it? Or should I teach you a life lesson? You seem to have completely forgotten where you came from. Is this your village? It's just too dumb to live in dumb houses like yours. It would have been better if you had lived in water then. But don't be afraid. I hope that I will help you get back to the forest. What is going on there? Why are there so many people and police officers gathered around my house? This is all very strange. Hey you, what happened here last night? Did I snore so loudly that I killed someone? Huh? Mikey, don't tell me you did it. I understand that he took our diamonds, but this does not mean that it was necessary to do this. JJ, is that you? I didn't do it. It happened at night. Look at this trail. How would I be able to do that? It was clearly done by some kind of monster, and it was very big, because there is no other explanation for this. There are more footprints here. It's just terrible. I didn't even notice it. But when I see it, I just can't believe my eyes. Where do such huge monsters come from in our area? It's just a nightmare. Maybe we could find this monster and kill it. Oh, JJ, that sounds good. We have traces of him right now. Therefore, finding him will not be such a big problem for us. Let's try to follow in his footsteps and find this monster. I think he ran off into the woods somewhere because his tracks stop here. So he was definitely running away from here. Then let's go to that mountain right on the way. I think we can find him. JJ, I think this is the monster. Look at him. It's obvious that this gorilla was at the scene. He still wants to kill someone and I'm sure he could do that. Hey, you, try to kill someone stronger than that old man. That's it. Although we are glad that you did it. But it's wrong. Let's see what you can do against us if you're not afraid of us. Or are you scared? Mikey, try to kill him. Hey, you monkey. What can you tell me when I put your head over the fireplace as a souvenir? Or do you want me to kill you quickly and go home? Ah! OK, I was joking. I don't want that. Please forgive me. JJ, let's run fast. This gorilla is going to kill us. Oh, oh, no, don't. We didn't mean to offend you. Forgive us, gorilla. <laughs> oh. Mikey. How do you understand that? Are we just dead from some big and dumb gorilla right now? I can't figure out what we did wrong. Do you have any ideas to get back at him? JJ, it was very fast and dumb. But maybe we should just go and kill him. You haven't forgotten that I have something very interesting at home. I think you'll like it. I'm sure we'll both like it. Because there is armor and weapons in my chest in my house with which we can definitely kill this big stupid gorilla. I'm very interested in you. Now I wonder what you have in your chest. Show me soon. Mm-hmm. Sheesh! Where did you get all this? If you had this weapon and armor all this time, then why didn't we take it right away when we went to this gorilla? We could have killed him as soon as we met him. Isn't that right? All right. Turns out the gorilla is a little smarter than you, Mikey. What? It's not true. If that's the case, then show me at least one gorilla who would have all these weapons that I have. I'm sure you can't. So less words, and let's go and find that gorilla again and kill him. I'm sure we can do it all now. Especially since all these weapons are just gorgeous, aren't they? You liked it, didn't you? I'll tell you just one thing. These weapons are simply incredible. So powerful that I'm afraid to hold it all in my hands. I'm sure the gorilla will like them too. Yep. And here we are again. Hey, you gorilla. How are you doing here? I'm sure it's fine. But you're unlucky that we came here just to kill you. How do you like this news? You didn't like it, did you? Then just wait until we kill you. Yeah, JJ. Of course. Look at this gorilla. He definitely doesn't like this weapon. He's trying to run away, but we both know he can't do it. Gorilla, stay where you are. We won't let you escape from here so easily until we kill you. You've done a lot of good things. That's why we couldn't forgive you. 
Why can't he hear us? He just runs somewhere and that's it! Is he really that weak? It's just terrible that he can't even fight us in a fair fight! JJ, let's catch up with this gorilla and punish her!